You know, I know I know where you're going with this because before you even ask me, I'm going to go ahead and put this out there right quick. I got emailed. Somebody emailed me and they said, Jack, they said, did you see this? This uh, Did you hear about this promo that Devon did about you? And I was like, no. I said, what is it? So they emailed it to me and I, I listened to it. And I kind of laughed about it at first because, I mean, you know, me and Devon, you know, we got a history, bro. I mean, you know, we go way back. I mean, Gary, you was there with us when we danced, man, you know, with ECW, you know, for years, you know what I mean? And I mean, you know, for what we stood for, you know, it wasn't, it's, it's not but like, really, it's not but like two original ECW tag teams that's still around, that's still even, you know, together. You know what I mean? They either gone or something, you know, and something happened to them or just whatever. But it's just like, you know, is the Dudleys and the Gangsters. You see what I'm saying? And where I'm going with this is he was talking about he would do anything he could to help me get in TNA. But then he turned back around and he said, I talked about him, and he's talked about me. We've done DVDs, whatever, whatever. But then he went personal with it, and he said, well, you know, Jack know me, and it was something about Tupac and Biggie. He like, I like Tupac, he like Biggie. I'm like, okay, those were rappers. That's like saying Tina Turner and Aretha Franklin got heat with each other. Like, okay, who cares? They were singers, okay? Who cares, all right? So, to compare how I felt about him to that was garbage, number one. But then he went back and he said, but if New Jack want to take this to the street, then, you know, we could take it to the street. Number one, Devon ain't never lived in the street. Devon never was known to be in the hood. And, girl, you know, when we did, when we was in ECW, bro, you would find me in the hood. You, Devon never did the hood thing. The hood, the, the hood for Devon is uh, 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 Disney World, okay? That's his hood. That's where he belongs, okay? Now, you come down on 13th Street off of 1792, that's the hood where we live, you know what I'm saying? Not where I live, but that's where, you know, you might find me down there, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, don't start trying to play big boy and all of a sudden you're going to start calling me out now because you're bored. And you thinking that, okay, well, you know, we can, you know, make some money, but if he wants to go real with this, then, you know, we can take it to the street because, see, the street is not where you want to go with me. You understand? Because, I mean, you know, and it ain't nothing to brag about, but, see, mine speaks for itself. You know what I'm saying? And everything that I've done, it ain't always been, like, you know, for play play. You know what I mean? And, I mean, I know that putting him and Bubba and me and Mustafa in any ring, anywhere, people would pay to see that. At this point in the game, and the way wrestling has changed so much, you know, from 10 years ago, 15 years ago, up until now, you know what I'm saying? It wouldn't be nothing for us to get in a ring together and make money, you know what I'm saying, which I would have absolutely no problem with that at all. But when you start trying to go street with me and want to call me out like, oh, okay, you want to take you to the street, then that's where, you know, it don't become personal no more. I mean, it don't become business no more. It becomes personal. But the thing is with us is, like, I would love to get back in the ring with him and Bubba. You know what I'm saying? Because, I mean, Gary, you was there with us when we was all doing our thing. You know what I'm saying? You was there with us, bro. And, I mean, you know, the arena wasn't a big building to sell out. You know what I'm saying? But it was the what we did, everybody knew about what ECW was doing.